like it? I just want to goof on this all yeah, day. Yeah, you do. Yeah. Yep. Quentin, Woo. welcome. I knew you would like that one. Welcome, everyone. Paul here, Music Villa, Bozeman, Montana. And uh, I'm here with Quentin King, who I know is a fan of the Martin Dread. I do have a, uh, a particular affection. You do. I know. Yeah. You can see it. You can see it when I hand you one, and you just don't want to stop playing it. No, no. Um, and this one in particular is, yeah. is just really cool. So what is this one? So it looks a little funny, right? <laughs> it has a <laughs> it has a little different shape. shape. Yeah, slightly um, different. It's a dreadnought, but mm -hmm. this is a 12 fret dreadnought. Uh, you know, normally it would join the body here, yeah. and that would you give you that would give those, you your classic dreadnought. Those two look. extra pesky frets yeah. that. I yeah. never use anyway. Totally. You know, I've never understood why you put all these things up here. I guess I some know. people use them. I guess it looks <laughs> nice. But. Well, and now your bridge has moved back a little bit too. Mm. So you got different bridge placement, which is going to give you a little different tone. It's going to transduce um, into the wood of the yeah. slightly different angle. Yeah. In the center, I guess. And it's, you know, it's just, a, it's a cool guitar. They're, I feel like they're, and, and basically what this is, this is our custom shop, um, something that we just do in the custom shop. It's got the thinner, Thinner top, mm -hmm. um, the one-piece mahogany neck. Uh, it's a rosewood back and side. It's basically an HD 28, 12 fret, souped up a little bit. Uh, yeah. Golden era style bracing. Um, so yeah, just some kind of hot rodded features on it. But yeah. basically, being a 12 fret also with the uh, regular headstock, not the slotted headstock. That's thank you. That's kind of the key. Like a lot of people, they. They just don't want. It looks so cool. It looks I just great. Hate changing streaks on it. It sounds, yeah, yeah, and it sounds great too. You know, you get that all that down pressure on a slotted headstock, and there's more tension, and it's kind of a different sound. So, uh, you know, it's you're going to get a different sound with the flat headstock when you do a 12 fretter. Yeah. You know, but it's cool because a lot of people don't want the slot headstock. And it's I'm just lazy. I'm just I confess it. I'm lazy. Well, Getting in there. And you got to learn how to do it. I watch our guys do it, and yeah. it's amazing. They do it but, real you know, quick. Your and guys fast. have like the layout. Yeah, they got the, the tools. Space, and it's just yeah. they make it. They make it look easy because yeah. they're good at it, and I don't because I'm bad at it. Well, <laughs> so it's, it's so yeah. play that again because yeah. I'm going to tell you. So. <laughs> Just for fun. Just same, for fun. Same guitar in a D18, so mm. this is mahogany. It sounds no. warm to it me. It does to me too, but people call it. Warm. But this sounds this yeah. sounds warm too. Yeah. One more time. Do that same thing there. Huh. Okay, both really great guitars. Really nice. uh, they're both 12 fretters. They're both custom shop. They're basically everything is the exact same except the back and sides. How do you compare? There, it's a tough for me to compare. You know, I, you talk to people. Okay, the difference between mahogany and rosewood, and everyone has a different uh, word. <laughs> right. Yeah. Uh, well, you're trying to take something that is so complex and subjective as sound, yeah. and and use the imperfect 
medium of language to yeah, express right. your thoughts about it. And everyone's ears are different. You're right. It's, so you're, you're never going to, you're always going to feel like you're coming up a little bit short and describing, you yeah. know, not just what you're hearing, but ultimately at the end of the day, music is an expression of emotion, right? Yeah. So when you're hearing this, you're hearing a tone, but it's hopefully eliciting some type of emotion from you mm -hmm. too. So even harder to capture in words, but maybe that's a little bit too esoteric for this uh, too too philosophical really for this deep. early in You're the morning. Getting really yeah. deep. I know. I'm feeling you know. I'm feeling a kind. Hey, of by way. the way. Yeah. Bobcats. Bobcats. Yeah. Yeah. So this tomorrow, uh, uh, we're, we're in the playoffs. Playoff we're, games. We're playing yeah. uh, MSU South Dakota. Bobcats. This this is yeah. the Bobcat, but it's also you can see this is the American uh, Native American mm -hmm. Alliance or something uh, like that. American Indian Society. I yeah. Think. Okay. But yeah. Anyway, we've so got a, a Native yeah. American student group in. in yeah. You know, the shirt was to support uh, yeah. some other activities. So MSU cool. Bobcats. MSU and, uh, Bobcats. We're in it. Go Cats. We're in it. And if uh, we win tomorrow, then that's uh, us against North Dakota for the finals, I believe. Mm -hmm. It's going to be a good good game. <laughs> good football. Yep. It's cold. It's, uh, They're playing it, out Let me put it this way. Cold. It means a lot to us out here in Montana. Yeah. Maybe not for those East Coast folks. Yeah, right. Big giant schools. They're big football. We're like, yeah. we're just little football. But it's exciting for us. Yeah. It's, we're there. Yeah. We're in the. We're in. We're the, in. Okay. Okay. So back right. to guitars. Yeah. <laughs> I can't tell you. I'm having a hard time even just like explaining the difference between these two. I like well, them both. Maybe this one's uh, kind of cuts through a little bit differently. <laughs> to, uh, even when I'm playing it, right? Yeah. And it's um, they're yeah. different. We I say just can't we tell say you this how. to everybody. Like if you're if you're checking out a guitar that you're interested in, it's not enough just to play it here. It's, yeah. You have to have somebody play it so you can sit on the other side and yeah. hear it because it's a different uh, yep. experience on this side than is that. When Dustin does the blends at the yeah. end for the comparison, a lot of times yeah. it's what I hear from this side is so different than when I go put my headphones on, yeah. and then it really comes out. It, it really, and you you said this one time that all these tones are relative. Yeah. Right. Unless you're, it can sound great in isolation, or it can sound not so awesome in your first impression in isolation but then yeah. you put it in comparison and suddenly yeah. it accentuates these these features that suddenly may be better or less awesome mm -hmm. depending on what you're comparing to yeah. so all of that is to say when we do the blends that's when it really stands out to me what yeah. i'm hearing both of these sound amazing though uh, they do i mean they're both marked that one seems brighter to me now you know, I've I like them both. I like them both too. Yeah. See? You'd come in here and like oh. I think you'd put in an eight-hour shift. Yeah, I'm still working off the strings. And he didn't work here. He just played no, guitars no. all I'm damn just still, day. I'm uh, still I'm still working off all the strings <laughs> I owe Paul that I just sullied and ruined back. <laughs> <laughs> That's what we should do. We'll do a video about the, this college kid who comes in and plays guitars every day for yeah four years. Just ruins them and never yeah. buys anything. <laughs> never buys it. maybe maybe you know like a pick. Because exactly. he feels so guilty, he buys a pick like, <laughs> once every four years. But look at you now. There you go. Yeah. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Thank you, everybody, for watching. Yeah. Uh, those are the 12 fretters. Um, uh, I would buy them both. I think the conclusion is you need a rosewood guitar and a mahogany guitar. Yeah. These because are Music you can't, Villa Customs, right? Yeah, Music Villa Customs. Mm -hmm. And you just can't have one no. guitar. You, you gotta, have to have both. you so, got to have the tools, yep. all the tools. They're both good. Yes, All right. Sir. Thanks. You bet. Thanks, everyone. Thank you.